Australia is home to many things. Vegemite, cheap lager, and a vast array of animals that are bred with the sole purpose of ruining your day. If you were to focus on Macquarie Fields, however, you'd also find there are a few ghosts spooking down under. The Macquarie Field Station was opened in 1888 and has remained open ever since. In 1906, a woman named Emily Jengerson was killed at the station after being run over by a train. The woman had been suffering from sleeplessness and melancholia to the point where she'd been moved to a mental hospital. On the day of the accident, she was boarding a train to visit a friend, accompanied by a nurse. As they got off at a station, Jengerson quickly jumped back onto the train, leaving the nurse behind. After arriving at Macquarie Field, she stepped off the train and wandered around the station. She was last seen leaving a tool shed before walking into the path of an oncoming train and kneeling on the tracks. Emily was reported as cut to pieces and the coroner ruled that it was without question a suicide attempt. For years since, a ghost is said to haunt the platform. Strangely though, the ghost appears in the form of a teenage girl. When the station is empty late at night, people say they can hear a faint crying. Others have reported seeing the ghost wandering around the station and even sitting in the middle of the rails. There's been some speculation as to whether the ghost is even that of Emily Jengerson, as other stories say it's the ghost of a regretful suicide victim, or that she fell in front of a train years ago. Others have speculated the ghost is that of a young woman who was murdered after missing the last train home one night. We might not know who the spirit is that's stuck haunting the station, but whoever it is must have a reason for hanging around there. A mystery it shall remain until somebody figures it out, and maybe then people will be a bit less scared on their way home from work. Subscribe for more.